Join in the channel at Snake River Rifle Works, and today we have something special for you. Check this out. We have a Scat Blast 1636 commercial grade sandblasting unit with upgraded guns, LED lights, the works. And I uh, really like this uh, dust collector. It's the 310. Five inch with a Baldor motor. Wonderful. Three quarter horse. God, this thing is built like a tank. Bomb proof. Two banks of three filters. Gosh, look at that. Things are massive. Look at this thick steel door. I mean, this thing is just. When you want to cry once and buy once, this is it. Look at that. Wonderful. Look how tall this is. I mean, it's on its pallet. It is a little bit tall. I'm um, going to stick my hand through here. <clears throat> Extra long, heavy-duty gloves. Some of the best they have. Just look how big this is. So it's a, what is it? 31 and a half inches jam, 34 high by 72 inch long in there. This is a dual operating system unit. So maybe if you wanna run um, left side uh, one specific PSI for running poly or even adjust it on the fly or even just doing um, Let's say metal aluminum that type of stuff at a higher PSI on the right side. Let's say 90 PSI On the side so you don't rough it up too much But then uh, I took some advice from a Facebook forum asked him where can I get some scat blast media or not scat blast media, but some sand blast media some aluminum oxide, 100 grit, and they referred me to Zorro. And uh, luckily enough, I had a 20% off coupon, and they have free shipping. Um, so I was able to get it shipped, $76 per 50 pound box. They, I went down, grabbed six boxes. So that was wonderful. But I, I was considering buying a the 19 by 36 unit and regrettably obviously that's a little bit too big for um, lift gate service so I end up going to the smaller unit and uh, uh, the people over at TP tools um, helped me out hooked me up with a wonderful discount just to try to make things right and help out and so wonderful um, have nothing but a great experience in working with them and uh, they also helped me upgrade the guns, the 25 CFM Plus guns on dual side on those. And uh, let's do a quick walk around. So we're kind of coming around. We'll see this back side. It's a little bit trashy at the moment, but we're going through a massive renovation. Not sure if you could tell, but uh, these are the five inch ports. And this is kind of the how far the pallet overreaches. That PAPS box was for size comparison. I mean, this thing's just massive. Not sure if you can. Here, let's zoom. Thick gauge steel, so that's something to consider. Welds versus rivets. That's one of the main reasons I wanted to buy this one. Things are welded instead of riveted. Let's see what we can find on the inside here. Hard to tell. I'll have to see if I can do another video when I get the LED lights up top installed. And uh, I got a 45 inch LED light for the inside. 
So that should brighten things up a bit, make a nice, wonderful sandblasting experience. I didn't know what sandblasting cabinet to get, but I wanted to keep my options open as go as big as I could. And uh, I ended up with this unit. I'm definitely happy with everything I see so far, but I think I might have bought too big a one, but is it really though? Go big or go home. That's the way it is at Snake River Rifle Works. Thanks for tuning in on to our channel. Please like and subscribe and check us out next time.